Hello and welcome everyone back to another episode of Minigame Monday where I've been hard at work but it's not done on the first game, of course, Connect 4. So sticking true to the original minigame map, I am working on trying to get the games done back in the same order that I originally did them in. And this one, let me, I, I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to get my bearings. You would think that I put this sign out here for 250-250 that it would be out in this direction. Of course not, it's out in the opposite direction. So, if we go ahead and fly out this way, we'll go ahead and kind of have the slow reveal of a little bit of chaos and a little bit of something that looks familiar. So, we got an official game board of Connect 4. And it's absolutely beautiful. I'm absolutely happy with how this has turned out. I still need to put a Connect 4 sign above it. Um, and basically what I'm trying to go for is I'm trying to make this look like an actual table. Like kind of up in the sky. So I'm going to add some legs to it. And I want to add some decoration to the floor of this. I'm going to add some chips. Maybe some drinks. And you know I'm, try I'm up to suggestions on what should go kind of down below here. But... Here's what's going on, okay? This is not a finished product by any means, and I'll kind of show you what's going on. There's a lot that needs fixed because there's there's a lot of command blocks down here. There's quite a few, and uh, I'm, I'm new to command blocks, so there's, there's some learning going on here. Uh, so before we even do anything, let me go ahead and clear these out because I don't have a command for clearing these out. And I'll kind of do a little explanation as to what everything does down here after we do a quick demo. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and use this line to clear the game board, okay? And this is a lot of set blocks. So, what it is, is you have this board basically going from having some, um, just, just having blocks in it, having the chips and then uh, some barrier blocks in there and we gotta wipe them all out before you even have an actual game and then here on the bottom let me go ahead and pull out my barrier block down here along the bottom that huge line that we just saw puts these guys in and this will basically keep them holding their shape so we kind of, we want these chips to drop and we want them to hold their shape so that way it looks right because we have these gaps in between and we just don't want the gaps to be visible with the chips. So let's go ahead and put this thing into action. Let's drop a red in, okay? So we have the red chip spawn and then it drops down, looks like the actual chip. So what's going on down here? As the chip is registered, it comes down here into this line and basically this will spawn in the actual chip itself. The last block will actually put in this wool. This wool will then in turn go ahead and spawn the barrier blocks to go right above it and it's timed out so that way after the chip lands then the barrier blocks will come in. So let's go ahead and hop on over here pull out the barrier block and sure enough we will see there there that everything is as it should be. This first line is absolutely beautiful. Let's go and drop in a black chip though and you'll see the black chip spawns, it falls and lands perfectly and now we can go back to a red and we'll go back to black Yada yada yada. It's absolutely beautiful and I'm so happy with how this is coming along. Um, now we can go ahead and go back to some red chips if we want. We could drop some red, we could drop some black, let's just alternate them, why not? Because everything's fine up to this point. Beautiful. So, what's going on here though, is uh, this is where things get a little bit buggy. So let's go ahead and just drop some more random ones in here you, you can you can spawn them like going side to side but I wouldn't recommend spawning them uh, oh actually some of these work look at that this line works and the third line works that's nice uh, but everything else here yeah there's a there's a little bit of a problem going on here and the main problem is uh, that none of the barrier blocks spawned here yeah, none of the barrier blocks actually spawned on that one. Uh, let's see. Let's. One of these definitely doesn't have any wall blocks. Oh yeah, these wall blocks. This one uh, missed its target by quite a bit, and that's why we gotta do a lot of bug testing with this. Is there's just some wall not spawning where it needs to be, and 
Yeah. Things will start spawning in just weird areas. A barrier block won't show up like right there. Uh, this one over here, I think this is another... Yeah, only two of the barrier blocks. No. Scratch that. No barrier blocks happened on this one. But I thought this one... What the heck happened with this one? This one should have went. What the hell do you say? White wool to 264.86. Let's see. Uh, I need to... Actually, uh, this should be fine. Let's see. Well, 264.86.252. Oh, okay. Well, you're spawning in the long, wrong location. <laughs> well, that's why. I never change the last number. That's, that's a bit of a problem. But yeah, that's kind of where I am with this right now. Is we got about halfway there. We're about halfway there with this game being done. Right now, I just got to do a lot of checking and a lot of testing to make sure that all the numbers are right and that all the command blocks are right. <sighs> and there's quite a few here. It doesn't look like a lot because, like, if you have Seth Bling and all of them, they have they have way too much time on their hands and they do weird things that I don't understand. This is all done by hand. Hand typing on every single one of these and it's just... Yeah. There's a lot of room for human error, but what I want to do is after we have this, I'm not going to make it so that way someone can be like, oh, the game is going to automatically tell me when you when I win. No, it's going to be up to how it is in real life, okay? If you see that you got Connect 4, you got to point it out to the other guy and you got to be like, hey, I got Connect 4, blah, 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 there. And then you guys will just go ahead and clear out the game board, blah, 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 and give yourself a point. I'll, I'll probably have a thing over here on the side so that way you can keep score over like on a side scoreboard, but that'll be about it. So it's not gonna be a whole automatic, ooh, hey, the computer told me I won. No, you gotta figure that shit out for yourself. I'm not gonna do that. That is gonna take way too much time with the knowledge that I have. So that ain't gonna happen, folks. Definitely not, but this is basically going to be how the basic premise is going to go. Um, I will give probably redstone dust to red team, and I will probably give gunpowder to the other team. And basically, um, once per turn, the team will get one piece. And then it'll rotate, blah, 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 back and forth. So I'll add things to make this pretty stupid proof. But, you know, I'm, I'm doing with what I can. <laughs> but honestly, though... This game absolutely looks beautiful. I'm very, very happy with it. Let's see if this column works all the way. I highly doubt it. <laughs> it broke on the next one. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, well, that sucks. How about how about this one? Um, this one should be black, and then red, and black, and red, and black. How much you want to bet this fails? Wait, what? It didn't fail. Wait, do I not have... No way. There's no way that I have a perfect one over here. What? Okay, so I don't actually have to test. I don't have to test one or three. Or, wait, we could check two as well. Do I have half the board working? Oh, God, that, that, that's a no. That is a no. <laughs> that is a definite... <laughs> No. Oh boy. Okay. Well, that was, that was fun while it lasted. So, that's kind of where I'm at with the game right now, is I have a ton of command blocks going. I'm learning as I'm going, and there's bugs to be worked out. So, hopefully, you guys are liking what you're seeing, and we will be back here next week with hopefully a finished product. Uh, any comments that you guys have for me, be sure to leave them to, for me to read. But that is going to do it for this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. See you guys back here next week.